thing is you guys like the last raw video where I just spoke to the camera, here's another one. I just want to talk about life and a quick lesson I've learned. So here it is. In life, people out there are good at things and they don't realise they're good at things, but they want to do something else. For example, the past half a year, I've tried being a YouTuber, I've tried making videos, and it was really interesting to me. But the truth of the matter is, I'm not good at being a YouTuber at all. I'm never going to become a famous vlogger or a famous YouTuber. It's never going to happen. It's never going to get there. Even though it interests me and I really want to, it's never going to happen. And that's just how it is. It takes years and years of practice, and I, I don't have that in me to do that. But then I'm naturally good at something called streaming. I've been doing it for 10 years and I just don't realise it but I'm really good at it and I've just realised I'm doing a lot of self reflecting recently and I've just come to realise that I'm so grateful and lucky to be who I am and to be earning the money I've earned in the past because people out there work 10 times harder and get paid 5 times less breaking their backs and yeah, that's what this video is about. I'm just excited to start streaming again. All I want to do is turn on my camera. Even if I have 100 viewers, I'd be happy. I, I think it'd be a nice way to start and build a nice small community. Naturally nice. It'd be fun, interactive. And I'm just excited, excited, excited for it. I, I can't stop thinking about just putting the camera on and talking to the chat and having text to speech in my ears and just having someone to talk to. and having the feeling of I'm doing something with my life. You see, the world we're living in is becoming really dark. People are becoming more depressed, more mental health is going up, everyone's becoming financially uh, unstable, financially unstable, and the world needs laughter. I don't mind being that guy that everyone rips on. I don't mind. I don't mind being that. I've, I've come to learn to live with that, that my job in my life is that I'm easily, I'm the clown. And everyone likes to make fun of me. That's my skill. I'm really good at that. I'm good. And that's the whole point of this video. It's a realization that my gift in life is to be made fun of. I'm good at that. Naturally, I don't need to try. People just want to rip on me and make fun of me. And I shouldn't be mad. I was put in this world for that. So, I'm not going to try and be a vlogger or try and be someone I'm not meant to be. I'm naturally good at streaming. I love chatting to people. I get excited to talk to people. I'm really grateful when people give me money. I like to talk out loud and make, I like to be social. Streaming is my go-to, not vlogging. You know, it's, so for example, here's another example. I, I had a friend at college called Sam and he was really, really, really amazing at breakdancing so amazing but he wanted to be a stand-up comedian and he tried doing stand-up and he wasn't that good like seriously he wasn't that good but he really 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 wanted to be a stand-up comedian but he wasn't at all good couldn't understand the timing the jokes weren't that great wasn't really it was a bit crazy but his dancing skills were just unreal was the best break dancer you'll ever see but he wasn't interested in break dancing he didn't care about that he just wanted to do stand-up and it's like People out there that have, nat my point is this, people out there that have natural gifts in life, they don't capitalise on it. They just kind of do, uh, yeah. They think it's normal to be that good at something. Like my fiance, she's amazing at cooking. Like seriously amazing. She made this whole sushi the other night for like eight pounds. I mean, go to a restaurant, you're paying like 80 pounds for that. She made it eight pounds and it was the best sushi I've ever had in my life. And she's also an amazing mixologist. She can mix the best cocktails in the world. And she doesn't really, she, I'm like, baby, I think you're really gifted here. And she's like, eh. no, no, baby, I mean it. You're really gifted here. You know, people, my point is this. People out there that are gifted in life, they don't realise that they're gifted. And they think it's just, oh, it's nothing. Uh, yeah. Uh, but they want to do something else, which they're not really good at. You see? And, and that's why I've come to realise I'm naturally good at streaming. So stream. What are you doing? Don't try and be a vlogger. That's... Even though that's that, do that as a hobby, do that on the side as something you want to do on the side for fun. You know, if you've got spare time, 
Focus on what you're good at in life. And that's the point of today's video. I've been doing a lot of self-reflecting a lot the past week. And I, and I know I've had no content, seriously, I'm so sorry. I just, I've, I'm just not gonna ever become a vlogger. I'm never gonna make it as a YouTuber. As for streaming, I will stream on this channel. I don't wanna stream on, on my main account. I don't want to. I wanna stream on this channel right here on YouTube because it's low key. It's lovely. If somebody wants to come watch my streams, they have to come their own way to watch the streams. They have to come discover our channel. I want to get discovered naturally. I don't want to try and go on the other channel and try and be big. I want to have everything low. Now, I've spent the past half a year earning no money, nothing, zero. I've earned probably in the past half a year under 10 grand. Pennies. In the real world, it's pennies. How much? You know, it's not good. And, and there'll, be, there'll, be, there'll be people in the comments turning this against me, using this against me, and having a go at me, and yelling at me, saying how grateful I should be. I know. I'm just saying, in the real world, that's not enough to near enough survive on. It's like you're struggling, you know? Um, and I'm because I've gone half a year without earning anything, I'm now willingly happy enough to sit on camera for five hours. Even if I earn... 10 pounds, 20 pounds, 30 pounds, that's better to do that than nothing. And also what I want to talk about is that when it comes to streaming, I want to do something in my life. Like I, I've been living the past half a year doing nothing. You know, I might visit some friends or I might visit my family. Or I might visit people that know me and there's nothing to talk about. They, they know I'm there just to waste their time and just to make conversation out of nothing. What people, pe what people want is people want to meet you because you've got ambition and you've got a job. So when you do see your friends or family or people that you don't know, you can talk about your career, your job and how well it's going or how bad it's going. And people find it interesting. They want to look at you and they, people, people want to surround themselves with other people that have ambition. Not with, not with bums, not with lazy losers like the way, I've, the way I've been. They just see you as a time waster. Oh, he's only here because he's wasting time. He's just using me for time, you know? So my point is, I can't wait to get back into streaming because it gives me something to do every day for the rest of my life. And this time around, and this is the same mistake I always make. I, I make the same mistake. I've been making this mistake for 10 years and I'm not gonna make it again. So the mistake is this, I will stream for a period of time. I will, it will build up and I'll make quite a lot of money. 10 grand, 20, 30, 40 grand. What, and then what do I do when I've made 40, 40, 50 grand? What do I do? I quit streaming because I go on a spending spree. Ah, I don't need to stream anymore. I've got money, I can go spend my money. So I would then go and spunk my money. I didn't spend the next half the year. I mean, what is this comeback now? The sixth comeback? Realistically, how many times have I quit streaming and come back? Too many times. How many, how many can we all count? I mean, there's been so many phases you know, I think we're about to enter, like, I mean, you've got the Marvel Phase 3 about to start. This has got the um, Woken Wolf Phase 9 about to start. You know, so my point is, this time round, when I get streaming and get going, and I'm, you know, if, I, if I'm lucky enough to earn some money, I'm not going to stop streaming. I'm gonna, no, we're going to keep, we're going to do it because I want to do it, because it's what I need to do. It's my gift. I need to spread my happiness. And that happiness being, me being made fun of. Me people ripping me up and making fun of me calling me all these names and deep down they love me, right? But they like making fun of me and using me as a punching bag to make themselves feel better. I don't mind being that guy. That's my job in life. That's my career. That's who I am. I was put on this world to get made fun of. As sad as that sounds, it's true. It's my purpose. I've realized that. And also drinking. I, don't, I haven't really gotten drunk in a very long, the last time I got, got really drunk was like June. I used to go out excessively in June of this year. I went out, spent thousands, just drinking, because it was a blowout. I needed to do that. It was like a one year from the success I had at the start of this year and the success of the cooking streams last year. I, ha I enjoyed drinking because it was like, yeah, I deserve this. Let me get really wasted and paralytic. I want to get that drunk. For the past half a year, I haven't really gotten drunk properly. You know, I'll, I'll, I'll get pissed. But I won't get excessively drunk because I feel like I don't deserve it. I'm not, I don't deserve to get excessively drunk because I haven't done anything. I've, got, I've gone nowhere. I'm not, I haven't accomplished anything. I've earned no money. Anyways, I know today's video is a bit of a real weird one. It's just a self reflect I, li I like putting up this vlog, so I'm just self-reflecting. But yeah, let's talk about streaming. When am I going to stream? Well, I'm flying out to America on Wednesday. 
for a week. I'm gonna vlog out there because I wanna vlog out there because I like vlogging, it's fun. Even though they're going anywhere, not really, not, they're not, never gonna make it, but I enjoy doing it and it's for good memories it's to look back on. Um, when I get back from America, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna start streaming. Uh, I've got a few things that I can't disclose. I wanna talk about, but I can't talk about it to you guys because then people are gonna get weird. But I, want, I, I believe me, I want to stream so much right now. If I can just put my stream on right now, that'd be great. I just want to stream. I just want to get it live. I just want to say, hi, it's me. How's it going? I'm not going to be crazy. I just want to be this. You know, what worked at the start of this year? I don't need to act crazy. I'm just going to be normal, be natural, and be consistent, and it will come. I don't, and I don't think it's to do with the platform Twitch, Facebook, TikTok or YouTube, I believe that if there is generally good content there, people will go out their own ways to go watch the good content. So, yeah, we're on a new channel without my old name, on a six month hiatus, and we're not even playing League of Legends. So we've got four negatives, and we're jumping in the deep end. If I, I, I'd be happy if I can get 100 viewers consistently without that falling behind, below the 100 viewer mark. That'd be great. Anyways, I'm talking so much now. Guys, thanks so much for watching. Sorry that I'm rambling, but I'm just, um, I'm just happy. I'm content and I'm, life is, I don't know, life is, I think it's got a lot of good things. I feel we've got a lot of good, good in store. Thanks guys, and I'll see you guys on the next one. I'll be checking, and sorry, sorry about yesterday's video, the Try to Laugh Challenge. I was in a really bad place yesterday. See you guys. Leave your comments. I'll be checking them later.